Hello, nice to meet you again. In this video, someone asked me to try making fabric patterns. You might want to try this method for wrapping paper or greeting cards. Let's get started. Create a square. Trick for making square or circle, simply tap twice on one side to get the square or circle with the correct proportion. Go to the symbol panel and add symbol from selection. Duplicate it. Create a template. Then draw the shape you want. After drawing, group it, or add them together as one piece. Drag it into the square of one of the symbols and try to draw more shapes as you think. You can also import groups or shapes that you have already made and put them here. In this symbol, you will notice that the shape at the edge of the symbol that extends out, we can't see what it is. Turn off the fill color of the square to none. Position the object so that the overall is in the center of the pattern and see if it work. Doing this, we don't have to worry about the continuity of the objects. You just keep drawing. Make a square as a background to see the overall picture and use the same color tone as much as possible. Draw more. Don't focus too much on my design. It seems that when I think of something, I draw it and put it in. This is just a guideline for you. I didn't design it beforehand. I don't do this type of work very often, but many people make money from it. Okay, it should be good enough. After that duplicate the square in the symbol, drag it outside the symbol. Move it to snap in the middle, it means the center of all symbols. It would be easier if you made a template from the beginning. Then group all the symbols, drag it into this square. That's it. We will get the pattern as we want. This is a vector file. You can set the size before exporting to PNG file for the pattern. You can learn a little bit more about filling with bitmap of vector flood fill tool. Or gradient tool for filling color in bitmap like this. Try it. That's all for this video. If you have any problems, comment below the video and I will try to answer as many questions as possible. There are many videos on YouTube explaining how to make a patterns, which is very detailed and easy to understand. I try to do it in my own style. I hope you like it. Thanks for watching.